Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of unboxing and review video and I'll be presenting the PowerEd wireless earbuds. This is a non-affiliated review. Uh, what it means that I purchased this with my own money. I didn't take money from anyone and there are no affiliated links to make money off you. So you're going to get honest and unbiased opinion about the this set of earbuds. So the reason I purchased this earbuds, the price actually attracted me and I have never seen uh, any earbuds offered by uh, PowerEd. I'm familiar with their uh, power banks and uh, usually they're very good quality. So I'm not sure if you know uh, the same quality can be present in the earbuds due to its very uh, low pricing. So this earbuds cost me actually only $22 Canadian and uh, I kind of find uh, hard to believe because uh, if not the cheapest definitely this is one of the cheapest earbuds out there and still I'm expecting you know uh, good quality or you know so so quality is going to be okay as well so the first thing I'm going to do we're going to just take a look at the pack um, packaging and then we'll just like you know look at some specs on the package and then later on I'll give you more specs on an index card so this is model Y1 true uh, two inch true earless earbuds and the package looks like this and uh, they have some information over here which uh, I'll go over it uh, this is you know wireless version Bluetooth uh, 5.0 plus EDR and then 5 volt input and the connection range is 49 feet or 15 meter and the battery capacity is 55 mAh single earphone and 400 mAh charging case and the time uh, frame uh, you can use up to 5 to 6 hour single earbuds and then dual earbuds you can use up to two to three hours so they didn't put a lot of information here but uh, you know uh, let's open up the box and then i'll show you what's inside and then i'll uh, give you some more specs once you unbox the earbuds then you get a set of micro usb cable uh, this is not usb c so this is micro usb and then uh, two uh, sets of uh, silicon uh, earbuds and one brochure. Uh, so basically that's all it comes with. So now we have uh, the earbuds right here. So let's just you know take a look at it. So the first thing I'm noticing it even before looking into the earbuds that you know it has uh, the cheap feeling. So it doesn't have any premium uh, feeling and you can tell that right away that uh, this is a cheap product and uh, there's no uh, power uh, or recharge uh, recharging indicator on the outer layer and then what i noticed that uh, let's say if you flip it then you're going to see that you know the cover or the lid comes off uh, it doesn't stay to attach to the uh, base so that's another you know problem so this is just a sign that you know this is not a well made product and then uh, let's uh, remove the earbuds Okay, so it looks like uh, we have power on, but one thing I'm noticing here is that uh, there's only one charging indicator right here. Uh, so usually for these uh, types of earbuds, usually I have seen three, you know, buttons or three lights here, LED lights, and then there are like, you know, three lights here too, but this one only has one light uh, in the middle. And let's uh, remove the earbuds. So I'm going to just take it out here. Okay, so I removed the earbuds and this is how the case looks like. So it doesn't, you can, you can tell that, you know, it's uh, cheap and it's not like, you know, well built product, but uh, you know, that's okay. So here we have this and I'm going to just, you know, set this aside here. Okay, so now I have uh, these two earbuds in my hands and I'm looking for the left and right indicator but you know I don't see anything like that so if you take a look at it carefully then I don't see you're gonna see anywhere which one is left and which one is right 
so you have to kind of guess so that's another uh, you know feature which they are missing uh, because you know it's too cheap and then when you like you know, handle the earbuds then also it doesn't have that premium feeling you know you can tell that you know this is a uh, cheap product so what I'm going to do let me just uh, you know uh, put it on my ear and see how comfortable they are put it on my ears and then uh, surprisingly they're not uncomfortable uh, you know they're comfortable which I was not expecting you know I was expecting a kind of uncomfortable feeling when I wear them but uh, they're fairly comfortable so I cannot complain there and then I have uh, tried some sound quality so let's talk about a little bit you know how the sound quality and everything else so in terms of uh, sound quality uh, due to the fact that you know this is like $20 uh, earbuds or to be exact I paid $22 the sound quality what I was looking for was not there so what it what it means that you know this definitely doesn't like you know uh, com it cannot compare with any other earbuds which are like you know $40 or $50 so the sound quality is not that great but it's not that bad either uh, it works and uh, the bass is there but it's not like you know any punchy bass or there's no like you know a, a good bass so it's just a very little bass and then when you're listening to music and in the mids I was kind of having uh, trouble uh, differentiating uh, like you know mids uh, each uh, elements of music uh, because kind of they're kind of getting like you know all together so I think that's just another uh, feature of a uh, cheap earbud that you know you're not going to get crystal clear music and you're not going to get be uh, good bass but still uh, it's workable i can like you know you can uh, listen to it and you can still enjoy the music but uh, yeah if you compare with other like you know f around 50 dollars earbud you can buy on amazon definitely the v sound quality and everything was a lot uh, less than that but it works uh, you know still you can use it but uh, this is not going to uh, you know cut it uh, if you're comparing with any other uh, earbuds which are slightly higher uh, priced uh, earbuds now I didn't have any difficulty connecting them to my uh, mobile phone or cell phone the connection was uh, fairly simple so it connects and uh, you know the Bluetooth the uh, level uh, or the distance is okay it does i didn't get disconnected or anything so there's no complaint about that but in terms of like you know the sound quality i'm not gonna uh, you shouldn't expect uh, like you know very good sound quality out of this but uh, it works and still you can have like you know you can uh, listen to uh, music but uh, if you are looking for like you know heavy bass or good bass then definitely this is not gonna work and if you want to enjoy music uh, like you know differentiating each elements and in the midst or everything then definitely this is not going to do the job it just like you know works but it wouldn't be at the same level like in you know, other earbuds which would give you much better uh, sound quality now in terms of uh, call quality so definitely the call quality also was not there so I uh, tested the call uh, this is my conclusion that uh, you're not going to be able to you know uh, use this for phone calls because uh, when I uh, listen uh, I'm going to like you know play the audio uh, of the call quality and you can judge by yourself but definitely you know these shouldn't be your choice if you're looking to purchase a set of earbuds for uh, to make phone calls hello sound testing one two three four five hello sound testing one two three now the question is whether you should you know spend money to buy these or not uh, what my take is that you know if you have a very limited budget or if you don't want to spend like you know anything more than let's say uh, $22 on a set of earbuds then definitely you can go ahead and purchase this uh, on this channel uh, all my uh, reviews are non-affiliated unbiased and on it so whether you buy or not it doesn't matter for me you know I'm not going to make any money off you by providing any affiliated links so that's uh, why you're gonna get only honest opinion uh, from my reviews and which uh, 
I highly doubt you're gonna find anywhere else because most of the other channels uh, you see for reviews they're all affiliated so basically you know you're not gonna get honest review but here it does matter uh, so I can give you the truth or I can tell you the truth so if you can add like you know another $20 uh, so let's say if, yeah, if you're spending $22 to buy these and if you can throw in another $20 $30 then definitely you shouldn't be buying these uh, go ahead and buy uh, something a slightly higher uh, priced uh, earbuds but uh, if uh, $20 or $22 that's what all you can you know spare uh, for uh, a type of uh, for a set of earbuds or if you just want to like you know uh, keep or have one uh, set of earbuds and you don't uh, worry about music quality or call quality or anything and you are worried about losing uh, you know your set then definitely you can go ahead and purchase this but in terms of like you know anything else I wouldn't recommend uh, buying this piece of earbuds that's all for today thank you for watching this video forget about subscribing this channel forget about liking this video there'll be more videos coming up so I'll see you shortly thank you